All right, what's going on, guys? This is Sona64, and I just got off of a game of um, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2, and yes, I'm still playing that game. Um, I wouldn't say I'm actually enjoying the game. Like, <sighs> it's still, I mean, it's, it's the same as, as I've described it before. Like, it's crappy. You know, you know, Commando Pro, and you know all the problems with Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. I don't got to go over them. Just Google Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 is bad, and, and you'll find what I'm talking about. But mainly, um, I've seen that when I hop into a server on MW2, it's just, it is way, way too funny. Like, I, this, this server, I just, like, um, I just, I just find a lot of good content for, like, commentaries and stuff, and today I want to talk about what happened in this, uh, server earlier, where, um, this guy, I don't know what his name is, I'm, I'm pretty sure it's Big Weber, B-I-G-W-E-B-E-R, but I all I know is that his clan tag was ARMY, so everybody called him ARMY, because he, apparently he loves the ARMY, like, he really, really loves the ARMY, he is behind the ARMY 100%, and, uh, you know, just backs up anything that the ARMY does, he's a ARMY whore, basically, um, but, he, yeah, uh, so these guys from the, um, Marines hop into the server, and they're like, oh, you're from the ARMY, well, Marines are better, and, um, I don't know why they gotta argue about this, but they just they argued for like four matches about this. So this is this is roughly um, 24 minutes, almost a game, a whole game of Battlefield actually. A whole good game of Battlefield is about 24 minutes, it's, and that's how long they argued. And it was the thing is it was funny because like he was just like, dude, we win everything. When he said that, the, the army, we, the army, him, we, America, we win everything, and. Um, I hate to break it to you, bro, but <laughs> that's, that's exactly the way I said it, too. I said, I hate to break it to you, bro, but we don't win everything. Like, we lost the Vietnam War. He's like, no, we didn't. We didn't lose. We didn't win. We backed out. And then, right, like, I'm like, bro, we lost the war. We lost that war. We don't win everything. We lost that war. He comes on, no, we didn't. We, we didn't win or lose. Like, I'm like, if you go to war to win... And you don't achieve that goal, which is winning. What's the opposite of winning? Hmm? He's like, the opposite of winning is losing. Yes, we lost that war. It doesn't. It doesn't matter if 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 we. No, it no. I I hate to argue it, but no. There's 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 no way we could have not won that war. Unless we won that war. <laughs> That's the only way. Like it's just logic. If you don't win. This is the part where you, you know, fill in what I'm about to say. If you don't win, uh, you're probably saying it, but anyway, the, the thing is, if you don't win, you lose. And I'm, I know I'm talking to a microphone right now, and I don't expect to hear something back, but um, that's the idea. Like, if I say, what's the opposite of win? And you go, lose. Yeah. We lost that war, and he just kept arguing, arguing, like, in his head, we didn't lose that war, we win everything. Bro, we, we really, like, that's where I had to stop him. We really, we really don't win everything. We don't. Because we lost that war. So, saying that we win everything, just, and the worst part is, this guy sucks at Call of Duty. Like, he was fourth place every single time. I was either third place or second place. And the last game I came in, I came in first place, which which I got off because um, apparently the game lobby closed. I don't know why it does that, but uh, occasionally, like, you'll play, like, five or six or ten matches, and then the game lobby will just close, you know? Even though there's, like, 20 people in the lobby. Well, 20, wow. <laughs> Never that. This isn't Battlefield. Unless there's, like, unless... Wow. Let me talk. Um... Unless there's like ten people in a lobby, uh, it just it feels like it just closes, you know, and it's just weird. Like I told you, like Call of Duty MW2 is, <sighs> dude, this this game is just, it's got a lot of bugs, a lot of glitches, and it needs to be fixed. But it's never gonna be fixed because, mm, yeah, they didn't care about this game. They did not care about this game when they made this game. They were just like, oh, let's make a game and let's try to make it awesome, and it came out shitty. And they were like, oh well, we made it, so yeah. And they uh, just, you know, left it in the dust and kept moving on with the Call of Duty series. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, they don't really care. That's Infinity War for you. But, anyway, that's the only reason why I would do his commentary. Because he, he, um, he just thinks that the ar like, the thing is, he backs the army so much that he looks over the army's faults. Like, the fact that we don't make all the right decisions and we lose people and we lose wars. You know, but whatever. You know, some people are just ignorant. So anyway, I want to thank you guys for watching and listening to this very interesting comment commentary. And I'll have another video for you guys later. I'll talk to you later. Bye.